This is gonna be a mini general collective tarot reading if it's meant for you, it's meant for you. Okay, current energy today is, oh boy, the lovers. Deep soul connection. Okay, could be a decision in love as well, but the potential challenge here is the star healing Aquarius energy. Now, we just had a full moon in Aquarius, so blessings and healing, wishes coming true. What you should focus on right now? Walking away from the things that no longer serve you. That's the whole thing about full moons. It's purging, letting go, surrendering. Recent past, well, are you on the offensive or are you on the defensive? It's time to stand up and make some moves. Now the strength position here is the Five of Cups. If you're feeling disappointment or grief in regards to a past connection or situation, it's time to let that go. The near future, you may be missing out on an opportunity because of that grief or that sadness, right? Or that defensiveness, depending on where you stand in that Seven of Wands we had earlier. The Four of Cups here says you have an opportunity to do something different. Are you going to take that opportunity? Suggested approach, Six of Cups. Stop living in the past. This is a card of nostalgia. Understand that the Six of Cups can also indicate a wish coming true and even better than you even imagined. So why not be open to that possibility? What do you need to know? There's the spark, the Ace of Wands. There's a passionate new beginning here. It's all a matter of awareness. Do you even see it? Do you feel it? Do you even believe it? The hope and or fear, the world, completion of a cycle. You might be afraid to leave the old behind, but leaving the old behind is gonna allow you to have a new, okay? And the probable outcome here is justice, balance, equal giving and receiving. 